when we are speaking uh, about ASDN, uh, it's very frequently we mention so-called reference points. Okay, so networking equipment, uh, telco switch, etc., is called NT, network termination, and uh, uh, customer premises equipment, PBX, for example, is uh, reference uh, referred as TE equipment, terminal equipment. In case of PRI, one terminal. One TE device can be connected to one NT device. In case of BRI, we have such connection, and also we have another kind of connection when more than one TE device can be connected uh, to the same NT device. Uh, this kind of connection is called point-to-point. -point. This kind of connection is called point-to-multipoint. When we need point-to-multipoint -point connection, when we, we are using BRI ISDN telephones. So point-to-multipoint -point, uh, method allows you to connect up to eight devices, I think, as far as I remember. Uh, also, <clears throat> the default connection in many, uh, default BRI ASDN connection in many Europe uh, countries is point to multipoint. Why? Because ISDN BRI was in, invented uh, as a replacement for traditional analog lines. So, uh, it was invented uh, to replace analog telephones uh, at homes with ASDN devices. So, this mode uh, has some uh, features uh, that uh, we usually can find in the uh, world of analog uh, telephony. For example, ISDN telephones can be powered uh, from the line exactly like uh, analog telephone. Uh, also, especially for this mode, uh, uh, in order to save power that uh, is, uh, should be uh, provided by telecom switch, the line is usually deactivated after, uh, let's say, 30 seconds, uh, then uh, the last call was disconnected. Okay? so. No calls, point to multipoint line is usually deactivated. So you see it in asterisk like deactivated, disconnected line. Okay? Many people uh, immediately call to technical support and complain that their line is not connected. Okay? Then we ask them, try to make a call, oh, connected. Uh, after 30 seconds, they call again, oh, it doesn't connect, it's not connected. Make another call, oh, connected. So, this uh, line behavior, uh, you, you, you should understand and consider. Uh, also, please note that this mode, when the line is connected and disconnected, it. Uh, very confused uh, asterisk. Why? Because digital line uh, in asterisk, it's usually source of synchronization, source of synchronization signal. So <clears throat> how it works? Then digital line is synchronized in special uh, time slot, uh, transmitted regular pattern of uh, zeros and uh, ones. Okay? This uh, Sequence is, is transmitted uh, with frequency, frequency 8,000 uh, uh, times a second, okay? And uh, this signal is uh, recovered from the line and used for synchronization all PCM uh, in the asterisk. For example, when you 
make a conference call uh, where only SIP phones uh, take uh, participation, we still need something that uh, just, uh, you know, uh, uh, defined uh, 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 synchronization of uh, the PCM. And this signal from uh, recovered from digital line is used. When such line continuously connects and disconnects, connects and disconnects, uh, it's very difficult uh, to asterisk uh, to continue uh, normal synchronization mode. Okay? So what happens? This line is disconnected, asterisk is looking, uh, is looking for another currently connected line and tries uh, to get a synchronization signal from there. Okay? This line is disconnected. Uh, there is no any digital line is connected, then we try to use uh, uh, signal uh, from another data device. Nothing is connected, we are in big problem, so we are trying to get uh, ticks from kernel. Uh, really big problem. So I strongly recommend when you install uh, asterisk with uh, B raised in lines, uh, try to switch to point to point lines. It's much more better for PBX. It's not just for Astribank, not just for Asterix, for any PBX.